Let's jump into the next one. Kaleidoscope. I've heard this one. I fucking love this song. the first track I heard by this band. Absolutely fell in love with them, dude. God, that bass tone is just...
this be considered symphonic? Or no, maybe not. That track's fucking amazing, dude. Again, it's another fucking amazing track. Um, I think if I had to pick one I don't like, it's really Afterglow because it just doesn't fit. Um, but I still liked it. I loved it. But, I mean, if I had to pick one I didn't like, it would be that one um, because it really didn't have that oomph, I guess you, I guess you could say. Um, but, dude, that track is fantastic. And the fact that there's a Morse code in that song, very, very fucking cool. Didn't know that. I, th I always thought there was. Because it, it sounded like it, he's doing like a Morse code kind of thing, dude. Very, very fucking cool, dude. Um, but yeah. I love this. I, lo I love this fucking album, dude. I, I want to buy this album. I really do. I, wanna, I want a physical copy. Matt, if you can send me a physical copy, it'd be fucking amazing. I'll give you shipping or whatever. I'll pay for it. I don't care. It's the, this this album's awesome. I love it. It's fucking great. It's it's a breath of fresh air for Prague, dude. It really is. I feel like this band is going to be one of the lead runners in the modern age of Prague. I think I think they're going to blow up. I really do. I hope I'm fucking hoping they do. I'm hoping they get to open for Dream Theater and everything, dude. Very very fucking cool band. Love this fucking band. Um but yeah, dude, that's a fucking killer, killer fucking album. All right, let's get into these influences real quick before we continue. So from my understanding, I believe that this is what these guys take in, take in uh, for influences. I don't know if they've heard of Stealing Axion, but dude, Connor's voice reminds me of the lead singer of Stealing Axion. Um, and not to mention the band's music reminds me of Stealing Axion too. Um, that's the number one band that I think that they sound like. Um, number two, I'm going to have to go with Devin Townsend. Okay. And then there's Dream Theater and then there's Periphery. And then finally we have uh, uh, Cybreed, kind of like cyber influences coming, coming on. Um, dude, it's fantastic. I love it. 